Hey guys, this is Akhilesh from DataSense. Today we are going to learn how to add a space before the second word in these names. Okay, I came across a video from DP Tutorial on the same topic and that got me more interested. So in this video, he is showing how to transform this text into this text. So let us see the logic behind it. Okay, so here we have some names. So first important step is to find the starting of the second name. Then I can try some simpler formulas. Like to get the first name, I need to find all the letters before this number. Okay. So I can say left of the cell up to six characters and I can deduct one. So up to five characters. So I can use left function to get the first and this second part I can get using right word. So this is the formula if you want to see. Okay. This is for the first part. This is adding space and that's the second part. Okay. So this is fairly okay. But the problem is to find the starting of uppercase letter, second uppercase letter. That's also a very complex formula. Okay. And if you are more into functions and formulas, maybe you can understand it. Okay. But you need to decide whether it is worth writing too many formulas for this. And when I read the comments on that video, okay, some people were feeling the same. Okay. Like here, Manoj is saying it's too complicated for him. Most of the normal users will find it that way here also. Then I researched on the topic a little more. This is the most important part of the process. Okay, find the uppercase letter in the string and all of them are suggesting different, different solutions. They are nothing but complex. Then I tried power query to solve this. Okay. So here we have these names again. Then I will go to data because in Excel 2016 or 2019 power query is in built in data tab. And here I can say, take the data from this table. So when I go, when I click that, it brings me inside the power query. And you can see here, these are my names, the first column. Now what I will do, I will go and add one column and I will use this feature columns from example. So I can select this column and then I can say from my selection, use the examples. It is highlighting this cell and then it is asking me what will be your solution for this. So I will write Achilles and then space with the second name. Then I will write Bhanu, Pratap and Rathor. As soon as I provide two, three examples, you can see it has automatically done the job for all of them. And when I click OK. Okay, that's my correct name. Now I can go to close and apply and I can load it to here. So next time if I add some names here, I just need to go to my power query table and then refresh. It will give me the correct results. It also solves the problem of three words. Okay, which was not possible using this method. So this is an alternate way to do the same job. Formulas are also okay if you are comfortable with them, but this is much simpler and quicker to do. Hope you found it useful and let me know in the comment section if you have some other easier ways to solve this. Please like the video and share it with your friends and colleagues and also subscribe to our YouTube channel so that you can get regular updates on upcoming videos. Thank you very much.